I guarantee you will learn something in this video. If you give me a little bit of your time, if you give me a little bit of your attention, I promise. I refused to lose. I refused to give up. I refused to quit. A lot of people like to give up on a lot of things with no reason. You know why? Because there's no reason to give up. A lot of people like to just give up and quit. I don't believe in quitting because quitting is easy making excuses that's where most people find their enjoy because this is the easy way to do nothing it's so easy for everybody to say I can't I don't have no I don't I can't that's the easy thing to get out of things. You gotta be hungry enough. I said, you gotta be hungry enough. There's somebody out there that is a little bit hungry than you are. So you gotta get a little bit hungry than them. Every time you learn something new, you're pushing something old out of your head. Every time you learn something new, you're running away from something old. And right now, there's a lot of people out there don't want to learn and it's okay it's not my business none of your business but if you are one of those that are hungry like me you are willing to learn you are willing to become a different person believe you gotta believe you got it in order for you to get it. And that's called faith. I believe I got it already in order to get it. Many people gave up on themselves. Many people gave up on their goals. Many people gave up on their dreams. Many people quit when they start believing the negative thoughts. It's not going to happen if and if I wait. I don't know if it can happen for me or not. They start living in doubt. Let me tell you something, something you gotta understand. You gotta do your part before you do anything before you accomplish anything. Many of us don't do the things that we want to do and don't act because of self-confidence. We don't believe enough in ourselves. It's time, like never before, for you to have the motive, to be motivated, to go above and beyond anything you have done before. So let's go. You are not who people say you are. You are what God says you are. 
don't listen to people that don't matter because their opinions doesn't matter but if you listen to their opinions they gonna keep you from your purpose in life you can't stop what they say but you can ignore you cannot stop what they say but you can ignore you don't have to respond to the negative people because response gives that person the power and the confidence to say more and more the enemy will remind you of every mistake you have made in your life he love to do that he love to push you down he want to keep you down he want to keep you where you are being against yourself is not going to help you moving forward don't get mad when people turn on you don't get upset when people talk about you don't even think about that ignore it keep working keep dreaming keep pushing keep being true to yourself stay to yourself Take care of yourself. Don't stop believing God. Don't stop trusting God. And God will take care of you and your life. The blessing that God put in your life is greater than anyone or anything that trying to push you down. You know who gets jealous when you succeed small people they think you are going up makes them feel bad they don't believe what god did for you he can't do for them so they start criticizing they think god's favor is limited but they don't realize that god has unlimited favor You might have made mistakes. It's taken longer than you thought. You work hard, but that doesn't change what's in you. With great favor comes great haters. Don't let jealous people steal blessing from you. The people that are never going to be for you keep you from the greatness that God put in you life is hard and we already know that you fight for your life right life is series of fights i mean just think about it you already in the fight you're already fighting for your life and trust me there's a fight around the corner just waiting for you it's time for you to believe you were made to achieve it you were made to make the impossible possible as long as you breathe it as long as you live it you got unfinished business you got work to do and you gotta get it done you cannot just sit down and wait wait for what nobody nobody cares remember that nobody cares you gotta get it done so what you gonna do about it huh what you gonna do about that situation? You got a situation, you gotta get it fixed. You cannot just sit down and feel in sorry. Your sorry is not gonna get you up there. Making excuses, let it go.
your excuses is not gonna get you up of that mountain remember that the day that you allow people's opinions getting in your way make you nervous see your dreams and taking the way that you feel about yourself you fucked up homie that it's the beginning of the end of you living a blessing life have opinions and feelings about yourself let people tell you their opinions but you you decide you take advices you don't take orders remember that you take advices you don't take orders why you got to have somebody calling you beautiful every day in order for you to feel beautiful let me ask you a simple question do you believe you are beautiful or do you only believe you are beautiful when other people say that you are beautiful i'm just asking just look at the mirror and say it i'm beautiful i don't need somebody to tell me that i'm beautiful i know i know myself i'm beautiful and i'm a better person now i wish you know the power or the feelings when you can say i'm beautiful it's very powerful when you can say i'm beautiful i'm proud of myself i feel good i feel good baby i'm proud of who god made me to be do you know what your problem is your problem is you never give yourself a chance to look up all you did was look down all you thought about was sorrow all you thought about is misery you got to start looking up you got to start climbing that mountain It doesn't matter how strong you are or how weak you are. You must climb that mountain. It doesn't matter how many times you fall. You must climb that mountain. If you're looking down, if you're looking over your shoulders, if you worry about who is behind you, how can you focus on what's going on? at the top of that mountain